Today I'm talking about the difference between twin flames, karmics, and soulmates. A lot of confusion out there, so let me try to help. Let's start with soulmate. So soulmate is your easiest connection. It could be romantic or not, but today we're going to talk about romantic. It is the relationship that kind of just fits. It's an easy connection. It's non-judgmental. It's sweet. It's kind. It's innocent. It could be first love. It could be love at first sight. It could even be high school sweetheart. It's highly approved. You know, people are like, oh, you're so good together. You know, your family loves them. Very similar backgrounds. You have a lot in common. But with this one, a lot of the relationship is what it looks like, not so much like what it feels like, like what it looks like to others, not what it feels like. A lot result in marriage, but some split up and then years later get back together and get married. It's not uncommon to hear that story. That's because there's something very familiar and very comfortable about our soulmate. But these connections don't challenge us. They don't make any waves in our lives. After a while, you can tire of them too or get bored. Now, what's a karmic? Karmic is makeup breakup, crazy, in cycles, you're never on the same page. One of you always loves harder than the other or puts more effort than the other. One-sided relationships, they are called also. Lots of ups and downs, lots of miscommunication, lots of distrust. They come on quick and unexpected, sometimes hot and heavy. This connection though is so important. We can have multiple karmic partners. It's important because it really helps us focus on our own inner demons. It teaches the harshest lessons, but it exposes our core wounds, the wounds that we so deeply, deeply need to heal. Karmic relationships teach us what we will and will not put up with. They teach us how we wanna be treated and how we wanna be loved. They really do strip us down very important not to get stuck on a loop with anybody or get caught up in a cycle. Karmic relationships are meant to end. Either you or they have some type of debt, but either way you made this contract with them to deal with these hard, hard issues. Now what is a twin flame? The other half of your soul. This is rarer than has made out to be. This is the love you don't see coming. This is the love that comes when you're finally on your way to being healed when you're finally on your way to being whole. It's the love that our karmics and our soulmates prepare us for. It's the one that puts us over the hump and closer to who we really are. It shatters all the preconceived notions that we thought we had about love, what we thought we knew. It knocks us out our butt. It's not something you can go looking for either. When this one comes, we might be on guard. We might want to resist it, but it fits. It's just effortless, even though it's intense. It doesn't fit old rules. It challenges you. It doesn't play it safe. Twin Flame asks you to walk the walk. But it won't come if we're still trapped in those old karmic cycles.